Welcome to this video. In this video, I would like to show and explain to you how you can check SAP users having access to an SAP transaction to one specific SAP transaction. So first of all, you have to open up the transaction SUIM to open up the user information system. Then you choose user and users by complex selection criteria and then users by complex selection criteria. Then it's important within logon data, within user type, you enter capital A. That stands for dialog. For example, if we had the search help, then you can see that uh, you have also the possibility to enter different user types, but A stands for dialog users, so SAP users working with the SAP system, logging into the SAP system and using SAP transactions. And then you move over to the tab authorizations and here within selection by values, you enter the authorization object S underscore T code. So this is the authorization object that basically handles authorization for transaction codes. Then hit the enter key or click to the button input values. And here specifically you can enter the transaction code. So for example, Miro for entering incoming invoices and then you can execute the selection and here you will get a list of all the users having access to one specific SAP transaction. If you want to within a list and then export for example local file you can export the file um, locally to for example use it within one external program but basically yeah you have a lot of possibilities here right now and that's all so if you have any questions left put them in the comment sections thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video